Health officials say the risk for lead poisoning rises in the summertime. When the weather warms, windows are open and home improvement projects begin, which can kick up lead dust. Doctors say it's important to be mindful of lead exposure in your child's play area. Children may also come into contact with lead if soil around a home or indoor flooring is contaminated with lead chips or dust from aging homes. It's important to keep in mind any home built before 1978 could have lead paint and may be a risk. They see children under age six who have a tendency to put things in their mouths are of greatest concern. That's because critical brain development happens at this age. Lead poisoning can have lifelong impact on a child's brain, including decreased IQ or neurological delays. It can also cause bone growth issues and gastrointestinal problems. Symptoms of lead poisoning can be subtle. That's why screening is so important. It may be just a change in behavior. It may be um, very vague complaints of abdominal pain or headaches or fatigue or something like that. And so often parents aren't coming in with specific concerns about lead poisoning. And this is why we do universal screening. So this is why we test every kid at ages one and two. Dr. Tucker recommends keeping, recommends keeping youngsters away from and tarping off areas of the home being remodeled. It's also critical to hire lead safe certified contractors to ensure everything is handled and cleaned up properly.